begin here in New York State. Governor Cuomo delivering his executive budget today in Albany, but one announcement he made would have a huge impact on the great New York State Fair. He wants to add five days to the fair, making it 18 days long. News Channel Lines Andrew Donovan joining us live. He's at the fairgrounds with more on what has to be done to make this a reality, Andrew. Rod and Christy, get your planners out because you have to anchor from the New York State Fair on Friday, August 21st, if the governor gets his way, if the legislature plays along. Joining me now is Fair Director Troy Waffner. A big day for you, but it also means your countdown is a little bit shorter. What kind of work has to happen starting tomorrow to get this ready on the, the 21st? Oh, you know, it's hard to believe with snow on the ground we're talking about the fair, but it's going to come before you know. And it's it's everything from amending contracts and working with vendors and agricultural competitors to, to really just getting getting the work on the grounds that we're trying to get done. I mean, there's not going to be a break between now and, now and Labor Day, for that matter. The governor surprised the entire state with this today, but any idea how long this has been considered or in the works? You know, it's been in, it's been in the works for a little bit. You know, just in a discussion phase and a proposal phase, but you know, nothing is real until the governor announces it, and he made that announcement today. And now we're moving forward with uh, planning for the 18-day fair. You now crack the top five biggest events in terms of duration. We have a list, and the the San Diego County Fair is the longest. That's obviously a county fair, and then I think the Texas State Fair is next in terms of state fairs. What do you make of you really being in that that top tier now, based on duration and attendance? You know, we've grown this fair to where we were one of the top ten events in in the country in terms of fairs or exhibitions. And, you know, I think by adding this days and really catching up to Texas and and then and San Diego in terms of days, you know, you'll see our, our attendance growth go now exponentially. It will be 1.6, 1.7 million. We'll be able to, you know, come, we'll, we'll be nipping at the heels of Minnesota and Texas before you know it. What will make this complicated? Will it be that vendors now have to staff their booths for 18 days, that your staff now has to work for 18 days? Where's the biggest challenge in pulling this off? You know, I think, I think a lot of it is just the administrative part of with the contracts and everything. I think, you know, we'll work with our vendors to make sure they all get here. And, you know, 18 days is tough, you know, because for us, it's not 18 days. It's really a month at the end of the day. So it's making sure people are taking care of themselves, working over those months, getting days off, making sure the animals, when they come on the grounds, don't get stressed out too much by the, by, you know, the, the added competitions and added days. But, you know, really the, the best part is the creative part of how do you, how do you build five more fun days of the fair? Have you been on social media yet today? You're, you're, you'd see opinions on both sides of this. Some people saying that's too much state fair. To those people, what do you say? You know, I say, is there ever really too much state <laughs> fair? I mean, at, at some point, you know, we added a day. It turned out to be a success. We're adding five days. We'll build this up. There's always, you know, people who, who think it's too much of a, a good thing on anything. But I think uh, I think this will work. Actually, I did read a little bit of social media, and I was most offended people were making fun of my hair. What's wrong with your hair? I don't know. That's what okay. I was wondering. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's cold out. It's a little breezy. It happens. Um, I think the biggest challenge is getting 18 days worth of gingham for you for the fair. So the shopping for Troy Waffner begins now. We'll have more coming up on this fair extension at 6 o'clock. With Troy Waffner, I'm Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9.